Have you heard of this idea called ricing a piece of pottery where one way or the other you pierce the pot and then when you glaze it, theoretically the glaze will fill them in uh, but will leave them translucent where light will come through. I'd never done it before and I was loading a kiln to fire and I thought, well, let's try it out. At this point, this piece of pottery is simply bone dry. It has not had any firing, but it will be fired. And here uh, it's come out of the bisque. And so it's had its first firing before glazing. I wasn't sure what to expect, whether or not the holes would simply fill up by a heavy coat of glaze. But in the end they didn't. So I decided to use a brush and dab them and fill them which already was a bit of a clue that this was going to be a problem because I know this glaze is going to show those dabs in terms of bumps so uh, we'll just have to see what happens so this test here is after I've actually glazed it twice I glazed it when you what I showed you a moment ago and pulled it out of the kiln saw it wasn't filled dunked it and fired it a second time and this is after the second firing you can tell it's still a fail. So here I am glazing it a third time and yes you can glaze a piece once it's already been fully fired and glazed but it certainly goes on thinner uh, it helps to warm it before you dunk it uh, but in this case I'm going to keep dunking it again and again building up a thin layer to make sure that once and for all these holes are going to be filled. So here it is after three rounds of glazing we finally got all the holes filled. I'll be honest, I don't know if I'd call this a fail. It holds liquid, but the differences in the holes, some are filled smooth, some are really deep. You can see on the inside the same way. I'm not sure. Let me turn the lights off and I'll show you what it looks like. I mean, you got to admit it's cool. And you can see the light holes during daylight. Uh, I did actually pour some coffee in it, and you hold it up to the sun, you hold it up to a window, and you can see them. So it's pretty cool. So if you've done this before, if you've had experience, you know how to make these look better post a comment down below i'd appreciate it